Did you know that pictures of horses taught researchers a very important lesson about AI and ethics? Let me tell you the story because it actually has a very important takeaway for anyone looking to replace the human touch with an AI model. A group of AI researchers was attempting to train a model to be able to detect if there were horses in a picture. Nowadays, this is a fairly trivial task for AI models. However, at the time, it wasn't. The reason they went with horses to train their model is because of the large amount of publicly available pictures on the internet of horses. After training the model, they first tested it out with some of the training samples, and it worked flawlessly. They started running into issues, however, when they started taking their own pictures or introducing other pictures from outside of their data set. And after some research, what they found out is that the AI was cheating. And what they meant by this is that the AI had started to recognize patterns in the metadata from the pictures on the internet and was using this to help in detecting whether or not a picture might have horses in it. What the researchers didn't realize is that most people who were posting pictures of horses on the internet at that time were using similar cameras or high-end models. The AI picked up on patterns that humans didn't in the pictures, and because of this, it produced unintended outputs. This example is so important because AI is very good at finding trends in data, and if we're not careful with the data that is used as training material, it can find unintended patterns that can introduce biases into its selection or the outputs of the model. This is one thing that organizations and individuals are going to have to be very careful with moving forwards to make sure that any AI they are using is producing ethical outcomes and potentially to still have a human observer checking over these things. If you found this story interesting and you want to learn more about AI, cybersecurity, or all things tech, make sure to subscribe to the TCM Security YouTube channel.